Greetings, fellow rangers. We're about to embark on an interesting little adventure. We're out to conquer an ocean monument. So first thing we're going to do, we're going to create a new world. And conquer the ocean monument. We're going to play in survival. We are, let's see, we're going to use a random seed. Um, we're going to leave pretty much everything the same. We're going to play in vanilla and we're going to play in survival in normal mode. So we're going to have a few little beasties we're going to have to look out for along the way. Um, we're not going to be doing a lot of monumental building or any superstructures or anything. We're going to do just the basics we need to to defeat the monument. Um, what we're going to do is we're going to go after three potions. We're, ooh, we're going to look for an invisibility, night vision, and underwater breathing. And we're going to try and get a pair of boots that have depth strider on them. Because that allows us to run really quick in the water. And it looks like we are in an extreme hills environment and I want to quickly move to somewhere near the beach. That's where ocean monuments are. Underwater. So no use being inland. We'll build our first structure, go down, get some resources, head to the nether, get a blaze rod for a brewing stand, and then we'll start Doing a little bit of brewing. Now, which way will the ocean be? Let's see, which direction are we facing? It's hard to tell in here. That's west. Well, if that's west, let's head south. Get, don't see coal. See coal over there. Uh, and a couple chickens. And it looks like sheep down there, too. Oh, what am I doing? Okay, first thing we're going to do is convert all this, make ourselves a crafting table, and we'll place that really quick. Get ourselves a couple of the basic tools. So pickaxe to get some, oops, place that in a minute. Pickaxe goes here. Yeah, that's what I need a hoe. Oh man, that's paying attention. I don't think I need anything else right now. We're just going to go... But I do want to take this with me. Okay, so we're going to go down and grab some of that coal. Let's see. Zoinks! Wow, nothing like being put right on the edge, eh? Ah, I think we can... Oh, there's some sheep. Be nice to get a bed right away because then we can sleep through the night and don't have to worry about it. But what I'm going to do is I'll come back for you guys in a minute. We're going to get this coal first, then we'll head out. Yeah, I know. Use the right tool for the right job. Okay. I guess I should get the right tool right away. It's still morning, so we're doing okay. Okay. May have to burn those later. Over here, we'll just make some more of those. Okay, let's grab this coal and get a move on it. How fortuitous finding this. So yeah, actually to defeat the ocean monument, I've defeated quite a few of them. And I found that you don't actually need armor, because if you go with invisibility, um, it's sort of the easiest way to do it. Water breathing po potions and the night vision and get three of each, which gives you, if you get the redstone and extend them to eight minutes each, it gives you 24 minutes. And all you got to do is go through it, get rid of the elder gardens, guardians. The regular guardians will leave you alone because they can't see you while you're invisible. So we just got to get a couple potions to get going. So let's see. Let's. Yeah, this will work out. 
Uh, that goes to slot four and then slot one. Sorry, chickens and sh and all of you guys, but might as well use this. But I do have to get food. But yeah, I really want to get that full. That would be a nice little perk. Whoops. A little bit of food. I'm not going to do any sprinting or anything. So my hunger won't go, go away pretty quick. Bow and arrows are useless in an ocean monument. Wow. Hello, bedroll. Okay. So, come up here. There we go. Uh, well, you're up here. Good lord. Could he get any higher up there? Let's see. I don't want to waste my tools. You know, I'm not going to use much. Oh, oh, an apple. I'll take it. Okay. What have I got? Two. Watch, I'm not going to find another sheep. I thought I heard another sheep, though. Is that a tree? Looks like it. There's one. Well, there we go. I'll have to grab a few more trees on the way, but the first thing I want to do is get out of this. This uh, overgrown landscape. There we oops, go where we've got some breathing room. Looks like a swamp over there. Is there anything else I need? Some more coal right there. We can grab some trees once we get out of here. Oh, it's not coal. And I'm not going up there, that's for sure. Okay, we'll gather some trees and food along the way. I do believe I just saw a chicken run by me. Okay. Oh, that's nice. I may get a bit of, once I get settled in a house, I may get a bit of a garden going. Because it's going to take a few episodes to get everything I need. Oh, here's one of my favorites, sand. Love making glass. Plus I'm going to need some bottles for the potions anyway, so. But I don't like houses without windows. I don't like not being able to see what's going on outside. Nothing worse than opening a door, coming out, and face to face with a creeper. So I like to make. Oh, that looks like ocean just over there. Lots of trees here, birch, birch forest. That's a swamp. So what? Hello. Let me come back. There's the lake. But we got to make sure we're somewhere near the ocean. I'm not going to settle down and then have to oh, pick up speed. That's handy. Whoops. Need the mushroom for the invisibility potion. Need the reeds for sugar. So we'll just grab some more wood. May have to spend the. F oh yeah, we won't have to spend the night in a little cave or anything, because I can make a bed right away. I can make bed torches. Oh, pumpkins, nice. Not that I need them, but I will have to do a little fishing. I'll have to get a puffer fish for the breathing underwater breathing potion. Let's see what do I need. Spy need a spider's eye. Need gold, carrots. Carrots are going to be tough. Maybe I'll get lucky and kill some zombies, or if I find a village. Oh, this could actually take quite a while. So, 
but I don't like I say I don't want to spend a lot of time uh, doing just regular stuff like coming up with automated farms or anything like that. We'll just go with the basics. Stay on it for. Might have a need for them. Lily pads are great. There's another mushroom over there. No witches. Starting to turn in tonight. We'll have to get our bed made right away. Don't need any ink sacks, so squids are safe. Let's see. Okay. I can't really think of a need for pumpkins, but I'll take one just in case. And we're going to sleep just up here. So, first thing we're going to do is throw down that. We're going to get some logs. Make our bed. Hey, let's just keep them here. Make some torches. Whoops. It was too fast. Oh, I've only got two. Okay. I wanted to get a furnace going, but somebody forgot to get cobble. And here we are. Make sure nothing's going to attack us. Hope we get some cobble right away because I see I'm starting to get hungry. So we'll just make ourselves a quick little shovel. Yeah, not that I really need one. Then we'll get it organized. Uh, yeah, shovel's all I need. Okay, get some cobble right away. There we go. But I had some. Guess I didn't get as much as I thought I did. I'm going to do a lot of traveling first. Like I say, I really want to get situated at the ocean, or at least on the shoreline somewhere, because I think we'll have to be going out quite a bit, doing some searching to find a water or an ocean monument. They're actually not tough to find. Might as well take these with me. Whoops. And I think we'll keep grab our pumpkin. Did I get a pumpkin yet? Yeah, I got one. And we'll keep going west. Which means the ocean is probably closest if I'd have gone east. Don't you find that's usually the way? You go the wrong way. But we've already got water here, so there's a good chance there's leads to an ocean somewhere. Well, that's interesting. Lots of red mushrooms in the nether. It seems we have to venture there. See if we can get some mushroom stew. I don't really have a lot of need for them otherwise. I saw some a red one. Yes. I probably didn't get it. Did I? Yep. Okay. I think we got more than enough mushrooms. Okay. So did I say we're going west or south? South. Is this south? South. Let's go somewhere warm. And what do you know? Here's the ocean. A nice little island we can get out on, build our house. Some more sand, some reeds. We've already got some. We should get those planted. Probably just check out the other side of this mountain. And then we'll set up. Actually, this looks like a nice little place. Oh, another birch forest. Mm. 
Yeah, right in the head. So Ocean Monuments were introduced in update 1.8, which came out, gee, you know, I'm not really quite sure. It was around Christmas, so it could have been a little before, could have been a little bit after. Fairly recently, anyways. Let's get an update. We're going to go over to that little island, get as close to the ocean as we can. I think we'll be doing a lot of traveling by boat. Do I have any oak? Oak. There's some pigs. Well, I know they're there. I don't need them right away. What have I got? Ten chicken and a couple mutton. Okay. Oh, there's another mushroom. I'll whack it with the chicken. Yeah, that's the best way to collect mushrooms, I think. Whacking them with chickens. Oh, more pigs. Nice. Hmm. I might have to change the view distance on here. Could be we're not as close to the ocean as I thought. This would be a nice place to build a house. I think what we're going to do is let me just get some dirt. Let's see if we can take a little look around. We'll pillar up, see what there is to see. And go from there. See if there's an ocean anywhere. We may have to keep moving. Okay, that should give us enough. 61. Actually, let's. Okay, first things last. Always seems to be the way. While we're busy goofing around here, we'll just get some stuff going. We'll throw in 10 chicken, and we can get rid of our old tools. Bring this down, put that up. Just because we can't use bow and arrow in the ocean monument doesn't mean it's not a good thing to keep around anyways. And I'll put it over here. And the reason for that will become evident in just a minute. I have my render distance on quite low or quite small. Let's just quickly. Oh, 16. Ooh. This might just really slow things down, but let's see what we can see. Hmm. Come on. And this is why I keep my render distance quite low. Do, do, do. You should show the curve of the earth when you get up high like this. This may just be a lake I'm running off to find so I have I can zoom in on things. Yeah, that doesn't look like much. The dark wood forest there. I wouldn't mind getting some of those saplings. Okay, that way is south. I think we're going to get some of those. And... Hmm. Well, good enough. Okay. Okay, yeah, we can spare a piece of coal. 
Okay. I'm going to chop one of these trees down. Okay, I'm going to let that despawn a bit. I'm going to come over and grab some of the dark wood. These things are going to be here for a while. Might as well make it at least look a little nice. The house, I mean. I like building with this. Whoop. It's like a jungle in here. Let's see. Oh, my axe should be able to take care of this. We'll whack it. See if we can get some saplings. Except I think you have to plant these in groups of four, so we have to make sure we get four saplings. Otherwise, they're kind of useless to us. Get the wood first, because I probably burned my wooden tor or my wooden hoe or axe. There's one sapling, two saplings. Okay, let's gather this wood. And there it goes, but I don't really need it much anymore right now. There's another one. Come to Papa. Where'd it go? Do I have it? Four. Perfect. Okay, let's go back over here. Uh, get out of the water. Okay. Where's my torches? Oops, better keep my bed. I'm going to need that. Just put these out. Grab these just in case. And I'll deal with you in the morning. Okay, end of day two. Hello. And I know I saw one just on the other side here. Hiding. Okay. Still have to head out. So let's take a little stock and have a bit of breakfast. Okay. I think we're going to keep heading in the same general direction. Make myself, some, make myself another axe. Just so I can chop this up. Oops. I don't know. No one direction seemed better than the other. We'll stick low and stay with the water line at least though. Plus, this will give us a chance to go back and see if any other saplings fell off this. Oh, there we go. One. Bit of lag. Looks like it kind of opens up over here, so... Oh, perfect. Look at that. So... And here's where our house is going, right at the top of this hill. This is nice. We got the dark wood there. We got birch here. We got a good variety. Okay, so we are going to make ourselves just a little bit of a shelter, a permanent shelter, just so we can quit carrying all this stuff. It's all about stuff. How much stuff can we carry? Oh, nice size. Perfect. And with any luck, there'll be an ocean monument right there. We still have to deal with that carrot issue. Hmm. So 
zombies drop them. The rare drops for zombies. Usually you can find them in uh, desert villages. And other villages, of course, too. Oh, I guess it's awfully dark here, but I guess that's just the leaves. Okay, we'll just give ourselves a... Square us up a little bit. Hey, it's not going to be the prettiest thing you'll ever see, but it will work. Okay, we'll secure it up and everything afterwards, but for now this will be just fine. And I think we'll get a garden going just back down there a little ways. Maybe I'll let 29. I think we can do this pretty quick, and we can make it quite cozy. There. Okay, let's see. How are we going to do this? Let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ah, that's a little big, so we'll just come in one. We'll have a door on this side. Ah, it's already off. Okay, just going to get the foundation done, and then we're going to call this an episode. When we come back, we'll finish, oh, of course, too short. Okay, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah, seven's fine. So this is going to be the general shape of our house. What have we got? We got some cobble. We'll have to go get more cobble. Put in a floor. Put in some windows. It'll be a nice little little shelter. We'll have a balcony that'll go out here. Maybe we'll have... Actually, maybe we'll have a house. Or a house. We'll have stairs down this side. And we'll have a boat launch. Bit of a Make a bit of a launch where we can have a boat. So we can go out and explore. We're still pretty low to sea level, so if we find a ravine or ca cave or something, we'll go down and start going underground, get some resources, because we do need redstone, and we'll go from there. So thanks for coming along for the ride, and we'll see you on the next adventure.